King of Ireland shall be crowned. By a priest. Honestly. Right, let's check our earnings, our income. Where do we get most of the money from? Tribal tax, actually. And our own holdings, the demands. Very important, but that also is highly, highly increased due to our stewardship. Uh, oh, the demands, I'm sorry, is all of this, I suppose? No, it isn't. Oh, the demands is our own holdings. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The county of Umerhain is giving us the most money, honestly. Alright, so... Our second castle is done. So we're going to upgrade the castle town because it gives us tax income. And we're also going to try... Well, we're not gonna upgrade much more because currently we need the money for the coronation coming up. Lovely, okay. I fall in love with my wife and hopefully she does with me as well. That would be grand. All right, so the priest is very happy to crown me. And it shall be a dignified ceremony. This one is not good. That gives actually negative uh, modifiers. I didn't know that before. I was like, well, pff, let's do 10 gold. I can live with less modifiers, but I don't know, we, we will spend some. So some kid has become some eminence. Cool. The time of my coronation draws near. Only a few more days before I'm crowned king before God and all my subjects. My court has been already filled with all the vassals of my realm. I have to bear witness to the fundamental moment of my reign. Right, okay. I was surprised tonight when Bishop Manny stated that he... That the period of the festivity I have organized is unfit for the severity of the holy charge I am about to receive. He has concluded... He scolded him by remarking that he has witnessed many impious acts and degenerate behavior during his wi visit. So, uh, he doesn't like us and we leave some, lose some piety, but that's fine. Ooh, my steward has collected a special tithe. So, we are a little bit back on money. Very good. Organizing such a great ceremony has given me a chance to know better some of my vassals. Maintaining healthy relationships with all my subjects. Uh, yeah. Let's, let's try and be friends with, with Bishop, whoever. And he agrees, so now we have a friend in the Bishop. Who will hopefully, thusly, pay us taxes. I kneel before Bishop Meinche, as a host of vassals surrounds us in complete silence. The Bishop blesses me and places a crown upon my head, proclaiming me King of Ire. Ire, by grace of God. I am finally and truly... King. So we were crowned by a bishop, which is the modifier that is over here. And it gives us a little bit of prestige and a little bit of piety. Being crowned by the Pope, of course, would deal much more in this. So who's at 88% strength? Them. Because you are supporting that for whatever reason. How about... We're a little bit better friends. Right now I'm going to bribe my way through life. And since we already have an heir, we're going to go to carousing. So again, we will go on a hunt. A hunt for friends and friendship. So let's do that. Uh, I think... Yeah, he's not at peace, so we can't invite him to carousing. He's not at peace either. So we'll invite... As many people as we can. Our sister, yes, that would be lovely. This bishop. And... Mainly looking for the dukes, really, right now. Have him carouse. Can't have him carouse, but we could join his war, which is over anyway soon. I oh, know. We can't, unless it's a jihad or a crusade. 
Shame. Yeah, we need to be a little bit careful. We do need positive relations with everyone now. But again, to keep the number of people that might become our friends slim, we should limit it to the most important subjects. Alright, so this should be fun and our threat was gone. He cannot join us carousing. He can... She comes? That's very good. Let's hope she becomes our friend. So we have a decent selection of three friends to come in, or three potential future friends to come in. Now we'll wait for the carousing to be done, and then after that happened, we, we... Yeah. Oh, we could do the Kingdom of Wales as well. And after that has happened, we shall go find ourselves new tributaries. Probably up in the north. Let's get this started. Alright, let's play for honor. And we lost, which doesn't mean much to us, but it's fine. People are usurping titles. We have a chance of losing stressed, which would be nice. Let's see. Yes, we lost stress. Perfect. Usurption, usurping left and right here. Okay, can we give someone this duchy title now? Please. No? We give this guy the duchy title. No. Glory Hound. They're unlanded. That's why they don't want to do this. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So our council should consist more of landed people. Actually, the guy we want to give it to, why not? Let's have him be in power here in the council. He's surely going to vote for himself. So let's try this again. Aha! Oh. Almost. So, let's replace... Right, they're against it because they're not dukes. He's against it for what reason, I don't know. Oh, look, there's... There's some Germanic and Slavic religion things. I've never seen these. Interesting. Let's become Dominican. Or let's not. <laughs> no holy man this time. Hope our wife gets pregnant some sometime. Be great. I mean we have an heir. That's just the thing, it's an heir, it's one heir. And heirs are fickle and fragile. Ah. Uh. What have I got myself into? People aren't happy to support anything. We really, really need a council more friendly to us to slowly put away some rights. Right, let's invite her to dinner. We can afford the prestige hit. We don't need it as much anymore. Lovely. She is warming up to us. So, to upgrade this further, we need to build castle walls, which we're going to do anyway, but we'll just follow this order of building. Oh, looky here. Interesting. So we could go, could go for tolerance, which eventually will allow higher status for women. But we don't need it 
honestly, we don't need it. What be, would be a little bit more interesting, actually, is stuff like Noble Customs now, because we have some feudal vassals. If we check out... our... Where was it? There. Governments. So lots of this is still tribal, but a huge chunk over here, Mercia, which honestly is a huge chunk. God, Mer Mercia needs to break up. Seriously. Um, the increasing those technologies might be better. They will eventually all adopt feudalism. That's not a, it's more a question of when. So, honestly, I think we're still best served with majesty. Or, nah, we're going to go with legalism. That's going to give us a few more interesting law options to fiddle around with. And let's check again what, what might be holding us back. Castle infrastructure, level 5. Or shipbuilding. We'll eventually need shipbuilding, so that's not something that we'll get around. So let's, honestly, let's put some in shipbuilding. And since we are a little bit sea locked really we might need more however we now have a huge heavy infantry focus so i feel it it might be very prudent to go a little bit ahead of our time here and increase the effectiveness of our heavy infantry because those are going to eventually tear through light infantry and since we still have a little bit of point left we're going to go for cavalry and leave the rest as it is. Siege equipment is not that important. It's it's not bad. It's a very good thing, actually. And it's going to eventually grow up as it is. So, yeah. We put some in legalism. These don't cost all that much. They cost, like, 15. 5. Let's, let's take these. Honestly, this costs nothing as well. So, we're going to upgrade those that are barely costing us anything. In terms of points... Because we cannot, absolutely cannot lose by doing that. We should reap the long-term benefits as long as we can. Let's check again what we need to build an empire. The Empire of Britain. Britannia. Alright, we need 300 gold, which we do not have. We need 80% of the counties, which we also don't have. And we need 800 prestige, which we have. And we need to have two kingdom titles. Which we could create. So it's really just a matter of expanding north. And or south. So. Let's check down here what's going on. You could go in a holy war because he is very much. What do we go in a holy war for? Kent? No. Now. Holy war for Vesex? Can't we just take it all? Can't press claims. I don't want to go in a holy war for just one thing. Let's extort some tribute from him. Because as I said, we need reliable allies and tributaries are very reliable allies actually. And we just had carousing so we can't do it anyway. Let's do that. Let's go ahead. And we're going to call him. And we're going to raise... Our own troops, which are still kind of building up, so we're going to go with our vassal troops, mainly, and our retinue. So let's get all these together. Collect down here in Mercia. Yes, of course he will join us. Lovely. And I swear to God, if I fight my own vassal in this, I'm gonna be mad. 
We're going to be hell to pay. Right, this is already a good army, so let's start marching down. Everyone else, we can just pull in after us. More heresy. Uprising somewhere. Uh, up in the north. We're going to use this army. Is that also an uprising against me? Nah, that's against him. We're going to take this army. And... Our own holding troops. Going to be pulled together here as well. So these will be sent north, take care of whatever that is. And he's not going to be able to finish his siege before we are done with him. Then we can go fight him. And we switch back and forth a bit. Or brother, he's going to be killed by those rebels because rebels hate everyone. Yup. There we go. A little bit decimated, are you? Let's go kill these guys. It's a straight crossing, so it's not ideal. Put in some people who know what they're doing. Alright. Artifact search. Nope. We can't afford... ...putting resources into an artifact search right now. They rarely go anywhere. And we really have... ...quite different issues to deal with. Let's ask our sister to spend some time with us. And we get to talk. Oh. So we're going to pick the option that gives us the most. Let's be diligent. And increase by 20. I am known as the monk. Why ever would I be known as the monk, I ask. What? All right, and we've increased her opinion of us by 20. That's good. Another 20. Wow, this guy is on fire. So now, let's take his expertise. And... Got that. Oh, he's leading. Oh, no, he's not leading troops. He's spying for me. He's researching. Right, let's have him scheme. And you go ahead and improve relationships at home with our spy master, hopefully. I mean, he does like us anyway. It's not, not too bad. Oh, well. Alright, we'll keep sieging here. They are re-sieging something in the north. Oh well. That's that done. So that's a new tributary for us. And a new definitive ally in war. Should start eating up all these smaller counties down here. All those heresies. Oh, we can already... Oh, we cannot stand them down. Why can I not stand them down? Because they move? Yeah. yeah. If they're locked into movement, you can't stand them down, apparently. Never tried before, so I never really know what to see there. There are lots of wars going on already. Can't declare war on you. Let's see, they're just in. Doesn't matter for what. They're in. What does it cost us? 250 prestige to declare war. Who do you belong to? 
Where do you go? To this. Can I give you this guy over there? Yes. Let's do that. Alright. Let's create a little bit of a stronger duke down here by taking some of these guys. Maybe someone would like to have vassalization. Nope. I have to force everyone. How much do you have still? Uh, holding here? No. You have exactly this thing. Blaukester. Alright, and whose claim would I be pressing? Who are you? A vassal up here. Hmm. So many choices, so much to do, so much work to be done. To hold a grand tournament, which we are definitely not gonna do because that costs a lot of money and money is something we are definitely looking to build up rather than throw out. We need to upgrade a lot of things. So we have some tributary income, tribal tax, church tax, city tax, feudal tax, but our main income is still our own holdings. And that's fine. That is just fine, honestly. We should probably also start building uh, shipyards, which we don't have money for. But that's just okay. Well. Right, so let's start a few wars down here for some vassalization. Now, why am I hesitant to spend prestige? Because prestige is a modifier for how people see you. It's not a large one, I don't think. So if we go by this, and we look for the prestige, it's plus seven. So it won't change this guy's mind. We should put him in the council though. What are you? Oh, you're military mainly. I don't want to kick you out. So let's change your... Change council position, and you should be... You should be my steward. Goodbye, steward. And you should be my marshal. And... You should go... Reinforce the levy. And you go collect taxes. And he doesn't search for anything anymore, which is fine. Do we need a new commander? She can be. Not so fond of me, but... Oh, well, what can you do? The council is looking a little bit better now. Oh, we could have... Someone who likes us. We have exactly zero people who like us. Oh, damn. This ain't optimal. Can I give you this now? People really hate this idea. See, I'm not strong enough yet as a king to deal with people like this. I'm just not strong enough. Once I gain the full amount of troops I can from my, uh, from my own holdings, I don't have to fear someone like this anymore. I can fight him even if everyone else rolls against me. Well, probably not, but I can fight him alone, which is good. Oh, good. Some gold, some extra gold coming our way. Right. Rambling about things. I forgot what I was going to do here. So let's declare some war over there. Forcing vassalization. They don't want me to do that. Don't want me to do that either. 
Also, I know. Also, I know. Okay, this guy is owing favor to someone. So that's not gonna help. Nope. 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 I hate my council so, so much. So the first law <laughs> that we should take away from them is war declaration. Which we can't. We have to take everything else away first. Ah, it's going to be a long, long way. A very long, long way. Everyone is against everything. So we'll look probably for future generations to change some of these laws. Centralization might be nice. But we don't really need it as of now. Title revocation, people aren't really for it. Ah, oh boy. What have I gotten myself into, I ask? Anyone important we could imprison? This guy. Right, let's check some plots here. This guy wants to kill us. Oh no, wait. I'm backing a plot to kill someone here. Or I'm invited at least. This guy wants to kill us. So him, we're definitely going to imprison. And... Everyone is kind of for it. My dear sister, who has an opinion of 100 of me. And my aunt. This guy we're gonna imprison. 100%. He might run away, but the council at least... ...supports my notion here. So he's going to be put in the oubliette as well. Enjoy. And I gave you this title. Oh good! Now we can have someone, some friendly face on the council. There we go. Let's have him take care of some heresies here. Maybe. Let's do this. Don't need heresies. And... He's also going to be our court physician. Or not. Good, okay. So we have two tributaries. Which is fine. So we are... Fairly safe from internal and external threats for now. We'll have to look toward what to do soon. Mainly taking care of our vassals. So let's see. Maybe we have a plot to revoke a title. That's That would be nice. A good title especially. Yeah. County, 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 county. County of Kent. We could revoke that from him. Let's weaken him. Let's weaken him a little. Well, our friend is joining, but he gives a whole 1% to this. Grand. Ah, oh, boy. I think I need to turn on the speed a bit as well. Oh, no. There's a high chance I die now. I am travelling by carriage in the countryside of Urmohain when it comes to a sudden halt. The road has been blocked by a fallen tree and the coachman explains that I will have to make a slight detour on an isolated smaller path. And there we go. After less than half a league on the small path, I am ambushed and surrounded by highwaymen. They send my driver on his way explaining that their interest lies with me alone. I offer the belongings I carry with me, but they merely laugh at this. It is my blood they want. <sighs> Thus we lose all our tributaries. It was a short reign. A very short reign.
All right, my aunt is now my heir. And my mother has been appointed my regent. Oh, God, no. We'll check the damage. We'll check the damage. <laughs>